Yeah, I'm a very grateful patient because of the excellent care that I've received. I don't look upon myself as being one bit exceptional. I think anybody that comes to these facilities and is, you know, has to use their services, I would hope to feel the same way, and I bet I'll bet the majority of them do. I could no pulse for about a half an hour. And Jeannie, my wife, God bless her, uh, knew how to do CPR and swung into action on that, called the ambulance, had to get up in the middle of it and open the door, unlock the door. I didn't know anything happened until two weeks later I woke up in the hospital room. They wanted to do a scan of my lower abdomen and the area of the spine that they thought was causing the trouble and uh, try to isolate that down before they did anything. And uh, while they were doing that, they inadvertently discovered a, uh, what's called a triple A, uh, aortic abdominal aneurysm. And Dr. Lee, who fixed me up a few days later, told me he said, you know, if that thing would have burst, you'd have been dead 40 seconds. It didn't take very long to bleed out. That's a big blood vessel. I feel really blessed to have the extra time because we're, we're all given so many things in our lives. And it's very easy to become complacent about that. Giving a little money is a is a good thing to do for an organization that has that seems to know what their mission is. It's been a wonderful experience for me to go through all this and uh, hopefully there's going to be many more years of interface going on that's still still ticking. I would recommend Mercy because uh, they have ample, uh, competent staff and they really do seem to care about a person's life other than the problem you're having. They, they, uh, they go to great extent to find out what's going on in your life and guide you in uh, what medical care needs to be uh, given. And uh, they, they just do an excellent job of that. you do that sort of thing, it makes you feel really good.